Bruno Fernandes has hinted that his desire is to leave Sporting Lisbon to play for a European giant. The Portuguese midfielder was the talk of the summer transfer window, but a move to Manchester United never materialised. Tottenham were also interested and even sent delegates to Lisbon to discuss a potential deal. Yet Fernandes stayed with Sporting and now he is refusing to rule out an exit despite claiming he is focused on the season ahead with his country and the Premier League outfit. I'm not worried at all, about transfer window speculation, Fernandes said after Portugal beat Lithuania 6-0 on Thursday. Since 2016, there's been talk about my possible departure. I'm well, doing my job and doing the best I can. I have dreams to fulfill but I have no need to force my departure. I feel the love here and if I have to leave, I hope I leave good memories. Express Sport understand that the noise surrounding United's potential move for Fernandes was mainly coming from Portugal in an attempt to drive up interest and his price tag. Speaking to United We Stand earlier this season, Executive Vice Chairman Ed Woodward admits he is cautious of players using the club to improve their own contracts, it hit a peak five seasons ago with 250 players. It was 177 two seasons ago. It's around 200 every year. We're usually after three players, so we might be talking to nine in reality. What you are referring to in the original question does happen, but it's less likely to happen give our closed door approach to recruitment targets. But it does exist and we have to be wary of that, players using the club. Sometimes, the amount of time a player or his agent invests into discussions, meetings and contracts shows that there is an interest. If it was only a flippant interest then they could go and put a fake story then go to a club president and go say look at who is in for me. That happens all the time as well. What sometimes also happens is that we do have a player in an agreed position, but his club refused to sell and, because the club refused to sell, the player then uses that to get a new contract. From our perspective, we have to try and see through it and make sure that the club is not being used. We don't waste time, we're more robust. Let's block ads. Why?